Welcome back. We've got a pretty awesome feature to show you today. Um, I'm going to kind of tease it here a little bit. Uh, but first, I hope you're enjoying a lot of our other recent features like, boom, shift click. I just added five cards to the cart. And then what's this? Use credits to buy these cards? Well, I think I will. What was that? Basically, we have an account called Peak Credits. And we just bought the cards for you. Well, in that case, me. Uh, Peak Credits just bought those cards and sent them to me. Well, how do you get credits? Well, over here in Profile, it will show you your credits balance. In my case, um, it's a little bit different because I have deposited money into my credits balance. Yes, that is an option. Why would you want to deposit money into your credits balance? Well, one, it saves on resource credits, on transaction credits. For people that don't have a lot of transaction credits, you can just send money to Peak Credit. And um, yeah, and, then, and it won't muddy up your wallet transactions. So that's awesome. But as you see down here, there is a new type of market trans or do order type in the history. And that is a uh, purchase with credits. And it says processing now. We're just going to refresh that and it's going to be processed. And so you're still going to see that all and you're still going to see it in my Explorer. And you're still going to see in the regular Explorer uh, what's going on. However, so that's pretty awesome right there. So what's happening? Basically, um, we are giving everyone a different tier based on how much account volume they have contributed. So we are rewarding more loyalty to the site. So as this goes up, and yes, I know I'm one of the more, I'm my own best customer. Well, actually, I think I'm my own third best customer. There are two people that are better customers than me uh, and because th this doesn't count the testing site that we have <laughs> where I've done plenty of tests as well. Anyways, moving on uh, down below that, you'll see your account tier and the profit sharing percentage. So every purchase that I do now, I will get 20% of the profit. This is not an entitlement. What we decided was we're going to give people some of our money that we make. And we think we believe, we hope that this will be long-term profitable because it will motivate people. We already have the best way to buy cards, obviously, and uh, and do lots of things and search battle, the battle chain, all that stuff, right? Well, um, uh, we think that giving you some money is, is going to be good in the long run. So 20% of the profit. So let's say I spent um, uh, $1.00. Uh, the profit on that is five cents, okay? Typically, not all the cases. Sometimes it's less. If you spend a dollar on packs, it's more, okay? Any case, five cents. So then I would get 20% of that five cents deposited to my balance at the end of every day. Now, that is not happening yet. Right now, we are processing them manually. Uh, just to make sure everything's working correctly and before we create an auto processing feature. So over here in pending rewards, here are all the rewards that we're sending out to people because the good news for everyone here is that we are sending them out all the way back to October 1st. Yes, we are we're launching it today on the 23rd and we are sending you over three weeks of rewards just because we want you to have stuff in your account i guess i'm not sure <laughs> we think it's good though so what i'm going to do here is process a couple so some people uh as you can see are getting uh three cents or less than that or uh 10 cents or a dollar 70 in steam and some people like agrid get 13.6 steam so we're going to process his and now it shows up in his account uh, we're going to do another one. I just, I don't know who Monster Monger is, but they had a decent amount here at 160. So we're going to process their reward and then I'm going to show you. I don't know who this is, so I don't feel bad showing 
I mean, everything's on the blockchain and everything's completely open to see. So it's processing in the back end. Now, if I refresh, it shows up with a credits balance. So now when they go to buy, <clears throat> they can use that balance. So as you can see, uh, they're probably a new account started October 17th. They've, they spent in a couple of days, 378. Uh, their profit sharing is 4%. And so that entitles, entitles, oh no, it doesn't entitle them. We have gifted them 160 of our profit and uh, they're probably going to go and use that. So there you go. Uh, you can uh, buy, back to this, you can buy cards with your credit. Let's recap. Why not? You've already made it this far. Oh, look at these three cent cards. I think I will. And the big benefit is that it won't muddy up your wallet when you do that, nor do you need to sign in if you're using Steam Connect. If you're using Keychain, it doesn't really matter too much. I think if you're, well, don't quote me on that. I haven't tested it on Keychain, on Steam Connect. So there we go. Um, uh, oh, I should buy some more of these. Okay, I'm going to not be distracted for a moment. And then it shows up in my Explorer as being a transaction. We'll change it so it doesn't say sale from Jarvie to Jarvie. That is something that actually Yab and Matt need to help us change. Not help us change. He needs to change something, basically. It's a quick fix, I'm sure. And it will show up in Explorer. It actually shows up correctly in Explorer. And it will show up in your order history. And so everything's on the blockchain. And if you want to add credits, we will tell you how to add credits. Um, because if you don't want it to show up in your wallet history and muddy everything up, it will show up on our wallet history on peak credits. And um, for now, we're going to manually process the rewards. And then we're going to create an auto process at the end of every day, which will likely be uh, Greenwich Mean Time or Greenwich Mean Time, whatever it's called. Uh, meridian time and uh, are there any questions you have I believe I covered everything and in the post I'll cover it with some screenshots uh, I hope you enjoyed that okie dokies bye bye